I'd better have a listen to that engine of yours. Oh, whoa! Hey, hold on, boss! We're for us! Oh. Thanks, Dan. My very special things to do when engines go wrong in the night book. Let's see what it says then. Ah, here we are. It says here that bus is sleepwalking. What do we do about that, Dan? Oh, yes. When someone goes sleepwalking, you must watch them to make sure they're safe. But whatever you do, you must not wake them up. Right, team. Follow that bus. Careful, Dan. Not too close. Be quiet, everyone. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> it's Astronaut Al. So you see, NG Benji, Spaceship wanted to go night flying. <laughs> so there I was, telling him to put his lights out because it was way past bedtime. And who did we see but Bus? <laughs> and no Dotty. Just bus. <laughs> shush, shush, astronaut Al. You mustn't wake Bus up. She's sleepwalking. Oh, well, in that case, what do I do now? <laughs> Look, Al, Bus is dreaming she's at work. So she stopped at your house because there's a bus stop there. And she wanted a passenger. So, um, what does he do now, Dan? Oh, yes. Take off, Al, before she gets you on board. <laughs> I can't, Benji Benji. I've run out of rocket juice. <laughs> well, then, in that case, hide. Where are they? Are you there, Al? Spaceship? <laughs> We're all right, Engie Benji. Bus has gone that way. So where does Dotty usually go after she stops at Astronaut Al's? Farmer Fred's, of course. Hurry, Dan. Farmer Fred will be picking his big red balloons tonight because they're just ripe and he won't know what's going on. Come on. Hello, Fred. Have you seen Boss? Ooh, eat her up! Egg and crest sandwiches! What's that? She's getting close to your egg and crest sandwich field? So she is! Look, Boss is sleepwalking, Fred. We mustn't wake her. So, um, what do we do, Dan? A balloon, Dan? What's that for? Of course! Good idea! <laughs> Look, Dan! Bosh is flying! She's sleep-flying! Only trouble now, Dan, is how do we get Bosh down? We'd better follow her and make sure she doesn't bump into any stars. Or even the moon! Oh dear, plain. Can't you sleep? Oh, now what? I'll tell you a lovely story. Now, which story would you like? I know. I'll tell you a story about... A flying bus. Once upon a time, there was a flying bus. There she is, Dan. There's Boss. Where's she off to, I wonder? I know. Fisherman Finn's next on the bus route, so she's bound to be heading that way. 
But what if she falls in the oh. sea, Dan? More by a bone, Jollop. OK. Funny? Fisherman Finn's not answering. He must have his earplugs in. Keep going, Dan. No time to lose. OK. Can anyone see Bus? There she is! <laughs> oh, no! She's heading out to sea. What do we do, Dan? The bus stop, of course. If we let Bus know she's come to a bus stop, she'll stop and come down before she gets to the sea. But how do we do that, Dan? Aha! That's it, Dan. A bit higher. It's worked, Dan. She stopped. Now, bring the bus stop down. Oh, slowly. Slowly. That's it, Dan. Slowly does it. Slowly. Slowly. Well done, Dan. All we've got to do now is follow her home. Oh, that's right, Dan. Without waking her up. Well done, team. Bosch is home, safe and sound, and we can all go back to bed. Who's this? Oh, it's Dottie. What does she want? Tickets, please. You know what, Dan? I think Dottie's sleepwalking too. <laughs> uh, yes, Dottie. We'll have uh, three tickets, please. Thank you. Good night, Dottie. Good night, boss. Vroom, vroom. From giraffes with a sore neck to snakes that have lost their slither, the animal hospital is open to all the animals next. <laughs>